Hi everyone, Don Genova here with another edition of Foodie Friday for Russell Books and today I have two cookbooks for you once again. One of them is based on seasonal menus. Great, why not? And the second one is about world cuisine and ingredients from a somewhat unlikely place, so stay tuned for that one. The first one is Cloda's Suppers. Suppers to celebrate the seasons by Cloda McKenna. Cloda is an Irish chef. She trained at the famous Ballymaloo Cooking School in Ireland. She's also trained in France and New York City. I met her way back when I was doing some food studies in Italy and she was a guest lecturer there. So it was fun to meet her. She's a great person and I'm so glad to see that she's come out with this book, once again called Cloda's Suppers. And uh, again, it's split up by the seasons. But also at the beginning, there's some great tips about how to style your table and make a good presentation. The spring menu, the recipe I choose from here is called asparagus mimosa. It is asparagus season right now. Get that fresh local asparagus while you can. Uh, basically, you can roast or grill the asparagus. And then what the mimosa part is, is you hard boil a couple of eggs and you chop them up finely. So you get this white and yellow kind of mixture that you sprinkle on top of the asparagus but you make up a dressing that's made with uh, lemon juice and basil and just a fantastic, nice, light spring dish. Now, I have to admit that the second recipe actually comes from the winter menu, but it uses rosemary and this time of year is when the rosemary in town is sprouting, it's, it's blooming, you can get some really nice, fine, fresh rosemary leaves, which I think is the best for this kind of a recipe because you're making rosemary and sea salt butter cookies. These are really fantastic. I have to say, uh, get the best butter you can. Grass-fed butter is fantastic. It, it has a, a much richer flavor to it and lots of rosemary in there. And it, uh, I don't know, I can't stop eating them. That's all I can say. So two recipes from Cloda's Suppers by Cloda McKenna. Now, the next cookbook is called Cook Like a Local by Chris Shepard and Caitlin Golan. And this place that these recipes come from is Houston, Texas. So you're cooking like a local from Houston, Texas. Apparently, Houston is one of the most ethnically diverse cities in the United States. And to this chef, Chris Shepard, he says, this place smells like fish sauce, <laughs> which is kind of weird for Houston. And uh, that's what uh, one of the ingredients that this book is divided into. Uh, it is divided by ingredients. So if you look at the index here, he starts with fish sauce. He goes on to chilies, soy, rice, spices, and corn. Each of those has a chapter. I decided to work strictly with the fish sauce uh, a chapter with this. And I, you know, fish sauce is not an easy thing for some people. This is uh, the brand that I'm using right now. It's called, uh, it's a Golden Boy brand. And fish sauce is basically fermented fish and salt. In this case, a little bit of sugar as well. If you smell it, if you taste it, you're like, what is this stuff? But when you put it into dishes, it adds a real certain flavor, almost indescribable flavor to it. Start off with the first recipe in here. It's a salad and that's a good easy way to get into fish sauce. I forgot to tell you about this one that I also have. It's called Colatura di Alici. This is an Italian fish sauce. I got to see them making this by hand on the Amalfi Coast anchovies salted and packed into tiny barrels left to ferment. Drill a hole in the bottom of the barrel and this rich stuff comes out of it. This one's pretty powerful, hard to find, quite expensive. Go with the cheaper stuff. <laughs> anyway, the uh, the salad that you make, uh, it's with uh, just nice nice lettuce leaves. The, the dressing is with some rice vinegar, some fish sauce, honey, yellow mustard, um, sliced carrots. You also add in some sectioned grapefruit and the fish sauce makes a great combo with grapefruit, grapefruit, believe it or not. The second recipe from here that uses fish sauce, like a cup of fish sauce, it's um, grilled herb marinated chicken. And you marinate some chicken in, like I said, a cup of fish sauce, lime juice, garlic, cilantro, honey. You put it in there in that marinade for about as many hours as you can. Put it on the grill. It is just amazing. And the, the fish sauce and the lime juice blend together with the herbs. It's uh, one of those, mm, can I get some more of this chicken, please? So those are both books, or both recipes from Cook Like a Local by Chris Shepard, along with... 
Clotus Suppers by Clota McKenna. You can get both of these books at great prices at Russell Books downtown in Victoria, or you can hit them up at russellbooks.com. That's Foodie Friday for this week. I'm Don Genova. See you next time.